Right, good morning, this is Eric on his uh, coastal kayak. This is the place of Ollenby where I stayed last night. Um, if you remember yesterday, Tuesday I paddled from St Bees up to Ollenby which is um, all the way up into the Solway Firth. Um, stayed in an holiday village caravan type park, had a little um, cottage, one bedroom, it was absolutely superb. Let me sort all my kit out and get it all dried and repacked so things are pretty good. Okay, this morning I'm paddling from here now. In about half an hour I'm just waiting for the tide to come up a little bit more because I only want two hours left of the flood. And I'm going to paddle over to that hill there. I'll be heading out on that bearing there. It's probably about five mile. Um, and then I'll then pick the ebbing tide up and I'm going to go all the way down the coast, it'll probably go out of view, you probably can't see it um, and you can't tell but you might be able to see a few matchstick type figures there, it's a big wind turbine farm in the middle of the Solway Firth and I'm actually probably going about another six or seven mile past that on the uh, south coast of Scotland into a place called Ross. It's a nice little picturesque beach um, and apparently I'm booked in a caravan park there that specialises in uh, wigwams and apparently I'm in a, a wigwam tonight so uh, that should be good fun. So just going round back onto this course that's where I came from uh, yesterday all the way down there round that head another 20 mile um, round that head south. Okay, I'm now, uh, I've got 20 minutes or so, half an hour, to pack my boat up. I'm going to get blooming all this kit into my hatches and stored. And then just sit around for the tide to uh, come and pick me up and float me away. Okay, that's enough again for now. And I'll uh, speak to you when I get to my uh, wigwam this evening. Bye-bye now.